All right, so welcome back. Hoping you guys have been a fabulous day. Today, we got the details of what's going to be coming out in the newest update. I was waiting to see if we get the official information, but it looks like um, we're not getting that just yet. I was supposed to drop today because the update drops tomorrow, basically, right? But no uh, no update information set out yet. Um, it was accidentally sent out early, which big W to the devs. Good job on that one. Uh, but it's not a leak anymore. I can now cover it because you sent it out. You messed it up, not us. Boom. With that being said also, um, yes, the community is currently under a lot of uh, thing of you know trying to fix the game and ask like, hey, we're like boycott, there's, there's so much stuff going on right now. Whatever you want to do with it, you definitely do. But yes, there are problems. Hopefully they fix those out. Um, and again, you know, censorship, I understand that. Uh, the bugs being very annoying and still no response on that. I understand that also. And then the paid for problems that you know people are paying stuff and still not getting what they received or what they're supposed to receive. Um, I understand all of those things. Let it happen. Continue onwards. Have fun with it. Get it done. And hopefully they can fix the game up. Still a great game. And I'm hoping they can sort these things out or iron them out. Let's see. <laughs> So onto it, we have the A12 patch notes over here, Christmas in Nikkei, beautiful, right? Can't wait for it, can't wait to have a limited banner this early into the game on a different set of stuff and a, uh, a character that people were originally liking a lot and now we're like, damn, she censored. That happened, so a lot of uh, stuff there. Again, what happened basically was, this was accidentally put up on the CN website and then took it down. They took it down just now recently, right? It was there for a while. I, I, like, I clicked on it this morning, it was still there. So I'm like, oh, okay, <laughs> you just forget to remove it. They removed it after a while, but it, was, it is gone now, right? Um, so what's happening? Since the patch has a pretty massive, here's a summary of everything that's gonna be coming out this week. So we have two characters here. The new SSR characters will be Winter Shopper and Miracle Fairy. Nice names, by the way, wow. Uh, the Winter Shopper just matches repeat perfectly. Uh, the Fairy one, eh, I don't know. Not, not a fan of that name, but hey, overall, those are the two new SSR characters. We knew about this. Literally, this isn't a leak anymore. The whole community, the whole world, like everyone knows about this. So much stuff was leaked. Um, so I basically am allowed to show it to you because like, everyone knows about it. You're not finding out for the first time for my video specifically. But again, there's also a new uh, SR character, which is Neve, by the way, for free. A new event, which is the Miracle Snow event. A new co-op event, which I'm super happy they're bringing back co-op. Hopefully it's not buggy and problematic and terrible like it was the first time. But it was fun. It was enjoyable. The rewards were not bad. I liked it. I liked it, all right? We have a new game mode, which is Arena, coming soon, which is the PvP, by the way, which we'll see how that's handled. Hopefully, they do it right. Um, a lot of games ruin it, bro. Like, like they really, really ruin it. But hopefully, they do it right. A new event pass, which is the Color Me Red Emma skin. Uh, well, then. New skins are going to be the, uh, what is it? Covert Nurse Maiden. Maiden is getting a nurse skin? No way. Uh, model Worker Brid. Bride? Yeah, whatever. Uh, sweet. Uh, what is it? Holic holy and the x is gonna get scanned joy of the nerves i need to see these um and then some bug fixes right so again that's the banner we knew about this i'm, I'm literally not showing you anything new um they receive alternate versions of these we've already showed these um as this thing whoops uh but we have uh also added them to the website today uh still their skills remain hidden until we get official confirmation about them that's that so again then the miracle fairy oh she's gonna arrive one week later all three characters are limited, so they won't be added to the general pool after their banners and event end. But when they return, most likely next year on Christmas. So by limited, they genuinely mean pretty limited, all right? So keep that in mind that yeah, she's gonna drop. They're gonna drop like in the in like within a two-week time frame. But I think their banners are gonna last for three weeks entirely. Um, I think that's how it's gonna go, but we'll see, all right? So again, new event, Miracle Snow, 14 login uh bonus, which is pretty cool. Story event, eternal memory, uh, story event, and then the mini game of gift factory. So they go on to say after the maintenance of the, uh, or on 8th of December, uh, both the first story event, Miracle Snow, and the Gift Factory minigame will start, but the secondary event, Internal Memory, will start a week later on the 15th of December. From what we know, both story events have different currencies and shops, so that's a lot of rewards coming our way this month. We'll post guides for the events once they're released. New co-op event, Gravedigger. Co-op is back. Um, this time, we're going to fight the dreaded Gravedigger boss. Good luck. We all need it. Beautiful, all right? Well, new game modes here. Yeah, it's, uh, it's PvP. It's going to be fun. The mode was removed on release due to some controversies, but now it's coming back. The good side is Arena comes with its own shop, so there will be another resource of skill, materials, and gears, which are worth it and pretty good at grind. New event pass. We have a new event pass here. It's rumored to be around $30? Oh, on top of the current battle pass, there's another one, so this is separate. $30 for once again? Are you joking me, right? What? We better get, like, freaking multis up the wazoo or some really good materials, bro. New skins, four skins will be added. You can buy them during the, uh, or while the Christmas, uh, festivities are available. Are they for gems, money? What are they for? We don't know. But, uh, Nurse Maiden looking, um, pretty good, pretty good. Model Worker Bride, or Braid, whatever. Sorry about that. I butchered it. Poli over here. Poli over here. My God, I gotta work on pronunciations of these characters. But damn, does she look pretty cool, too. I don't know. Number one. Uh, <laughs> look at this dude, Joy of the Nerds. Uh, what's number two though? This I'm saying number one. 
uh we'll do two three then four here i don't know i, I don't know who to, how to rate this but they're pretty good uh same the patch notes here bug fixes we'll, we'll see what the bug fixes are to maintenance so a pretty decent patch notes a lot of stuff in here uh, but again, let me know how you feel about it. Are you summoning for the entire event? Are you going to not summon? Are you going to skip it? What are you going to do? What's your entire plan here? Uh, it's still a good banner on the side of limited because if you want this, you know, you got to summon now or you never get it again. But there is a better banner coming out soon for uh, a lot of players. That's actually a strong and very reliable unit. Um, with it, though, it's not a limited banner. So appear on multiple banners and you have a chance to pull for them. Um, so I don't know. It's up to you, right? It's up to you. I'm not going to make a should you summon on this really um, until like we have uh, concrete like skills and all of that. Uh, they are good characters, right? They are. We know the skills already. But it's like they're limited. Cool. That is the case. Like you can't get dupes for them. So you're going to get one copy. And then what, what about like the rest of it? I mean, if a collab drops too, remember, it's a limited thing too. And you need dupes for some of the stuff, you know? So um that will be a problem forever for a lot of the content in this game and it looks like that's gonna remain a problem for a lot of time to come which it does suck that's how it's gonna be but games have their own thing uh i'm not a fan of it in this one specifically but still some games do stuff like that right so again there is that that's the entire limited breakdown uh you still need all the dupes and all that you know again i know you have the synchro device but that doesn't really help you after the time um so those are things just to keep in the back of your head after everything it is a limited banner it is all of this the content update is pretty good though on the side of things hopefully they have patches of like bugs and they fix problems that are currently occurring because there's a lot of that all right i get it you can drop two characters back to back you can drop all of this stuff but you can't drop bug fixes which are the biggest things so i really want to see a lot of the stuff get patched up in this entire update and see a lot of the stuff work and at least a decent conversation competition right like we've been we've been suffering we've been definitely suffering on a lot of stuff here so a, a nice conversation would be great but it's fully up to them no Knowing them, they'll give us like two cents and a, an IOU. So get ready for 1K credits and an IOU, boys. Be prepared. And then again, I really wonder how they're going to handle uh, the PvP aspect of it. Hopefully it's not like a paywalled, super garbage type of thing. And I really, I wonder how the gameplay of this game is going to actually handle PvP. That'll be a pretty fun thing to uh, to kind of go through. But again, let me know what you think about it down below. What do you think about the entire update? Again, finish up everything we currently have with the banner itself and the entire like event board. Um, so have fun with it. Enjoy, enjoy uh i really am scared for pvp genuinely it's fun i know it's going to be fun in some in some capacity but how is it going to work how is it like the entire aspect of it uh that's something that we'll have to wait and see is it like you're you know if you if you rank in pvp that's where your the rest of the currency comes from it would be good if they do put some currency in that aspect of it um but you know it's like only the whales at the top get the majority of the currency that's another thing to break down so it's a, it's a real iffy one. PvP is a real iffy thing in like a lot of games. They never get it right or they do get it right. It's just, it's in the middle. It, it usually works uh, or it doesn't work. There's no in-between. That's what it is, right? So uh, we'll see. We'll see. There's a lot of uh, content in this update. Maybe the rest of it's pretty good. Co-op is coming back, which is the big W, but PvP, that's scary. That's, that's scaring me already. Peace out. Enjoy. That's been it for me. That's been it. And yeah.